welcome back to my place. Happy fall, it's finally fall so we can start baking. And as I was scrolling through Pinterest for hours and hours and hours to find something to bake for fall, I found pumpkin cheesecake bars. I mean, what's more fall than that? I mean, fall is like cream cheese and pumpkin, right? Okay, to make these bars, you will need Then preheat your oven to 300 degrees Fahrenheit. Line a 13 by 9 baking pan with parchment paper, leaving about one inch of paper hanging on the sides. In a medium sized bowl, combine the graham cracker crumbs with the melted butter. With your fingers, press the crust on the bottom of the prepared pan and then set aside. To make the filling in the bowl of a stand mixer, add the cream cheese and sugar. With the paddle attachment, beat on low until light and fluffy. Beat in the eggs one at a time until just combined. Then spoon half of the mixture over the crust evenly. To the remaining cream cheese mixture, add the pumpkin puree and the pumpkin spice. Stir until smooth, then carefully spoon over mixture in the pan. Bake the cheesecake in the preheated oven for 50 minutes or until just set. Turn off the oven and leave the door ajar allowing the cheesecake to slowly cool down for about an hour or so. Refrigerate for at least 3 hours before cutting into bars. Top each bar with whipped cream and dust with pumpkin spice. It is that easy. That is it. Taste wise, no complaints. They were delicious. So satisfying with some coffee. It was so freaking good. No complaints. That recipe was perfect. I love how pretty it looks with the two layers. So I really like that. And um, just putting the nice um, whipped cream on top, just, ooh, so good. I wish I had some right now. I should probably make some. I have cream cheese in my fridge. So, yes, make it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Give this video a big ol' thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I hope it inspires you to do some fall baking. So if you bake anything, please tag me in it on Instagram and Twitter. You can hashtag it Paloma's Place or just tag me at Paloma's Place and I'll be sure to check it out. I really want to see what you guys are up to. If you guys have any suggestions for any videos this fall season or for winter, let me know in the comments down below. And if you haven't already subscribed, please do so. I'm trying to build a community of home bakers like you, like me, so we can share our love for baking. And that's about it. Bake, be happy, and I will see you guys here next time. Bye!